Imagine this, you're writing the last couple of notes before a big exam or business presentation and boom, you knock your coffee over and your notes are ruined. Regret sets in. If only somehow you had backed up your written notes. Well, do I have a product for you? Welcome back friends, William Dorman and boy do I have a cool product for you. Before we get into that, I'm going to be giving away a 300 Rand Take A Lot voucher at the end of this video. So stay all the way to the end to see how you can win. So today I have for you the Rocket Book. So for those of you who don't know, the Rocket Book actually featured on season 8, episode 24 of Shark Tank, where it was actually denied. So I cannot believe I spent 700 brand on a product that was denied by Shark Tank. Enough chit chat, let's unbox this product. And we've got the Rocket Book, ladies and gentlemen. The package is extremely good quality because for 700 Rand, this is the type of packaging that I expect. So this smart reusable notebook connects with the Rocket Book app to connect to the following apps. Google Drive, email, Evernote. So I'm gonna unbox her and see what she's all about. So we got the Rocketbook notebook. Quality of the notebook, is got, it's got a hard cover on the outside and on the inside, it's got its pages. And its pages almost feel like that of a whiteboard type material. So the next thing that I get is this small little dish rag type thing. And I'm hoping that number one, I can clean the Rocketbook with it and number two, do the dishes later with it. So next up, we've got the user manual and the user manual seems to be quite short and easy. So over here, you can see it says friction pen inside. So next up, we've got the Fusion Pen, and the Fusion Pen looks like it's something out of my grade seven year. So if I have to compare the two, the pen looks like it's something that comes from any old stationery shop where the book looks like it's custom made for me. So now that we've spoken about the book and the pen, let's try out the Rocket Book. The first thing that I notice is that when I'm writing in the Rocket Book, it feels very slippery. It feels like the ink will smudge very easily. One of the biggest advantages of the Rocket Book is that you can reuse the pages. And as you can see, the pages wipe clean within seconds. Now that we've created some notes, Notes. Let's save those notes online. So we can scan them in and choose where we want them to be saved to. The quality of the note is pretty good. Let's compare this to taking a normal picture of the same note. Rocket Book takes us one step further. While I was writing, you may have noticed the small symbols at the bottom of each page. These symbols are going to allow me to save notes to different destinations automatically. So for an example, I'm going to set the diamond indicator to Evernote and the clover symbol to my email. It's as simple as scratching out the icons that I'm not going to be using so that it can save to the correct place. And as you can see, this document is now saved to Evernote and also to my email. So I've got a lot to say about the Rocket Book. What are the pros of the Rocket Book? The first pro is that it can categorize your notes. The book is extremely good quality. Another pro is the app is extremely easy to use. It can save your notes into different online platforms. So for the cons, it isn't for lefties. Another con of the Rocket Book is that it takes long to dry after using the dish rag. So what do I rate the Rocket Book? I'm gonna split it right down the middle and come in with three stars for this product. It's so expensive that it's almost not worth it. The technology itself is extremely impressive. You might get away with impressing a couple of co-workers or some friends at school. Thank you for joining us for another episode and as you can see the Rocket Book has a couple of pros and cons. I'm going to be using the Rocket Book from here on out every day at work. Let me know in the comments what you thought of the Rocket Book and if you would actually use something like this. So now, for the real reason you actually stay to the end, you want to find out how to win the 300 Rand Take A Lot voucher. It's as easy as this. Leave a like, leave a comment on this video and subscribe. Once again, thank you so much for joining me in this video and for all the support I've received recently. I'll catch you in the next video on the flip side. Don't See ya. Make me dance.